Welcome, welcome, welcome to Character Kitchen. I'm so glad you joined us again. This week we start a very brand new series. It's the Lent series, which will follow into the Easter series. So before we start today's episode, let's have some worship time. Call your dad, call your mother, call your friends, call your brothers and sisters. It's worship time. I'm so glad you stayed after our worship time. Now, worship is the most important time during a church service because that's where you give your heart and your soul and your voice to God. Now, our series is about Lent, which leads on to Easter. Now, I don't have my Easter bunny ears on, but trust me, next week I will. Now, Lent is the most important time of our church calendar because it leads to Easter where Jesus dies and resurrects after three days. Now what I want you to do is to take a look at this beautiful story that explains Lent and Easter in a few minutes. I'll see you just now. Ask the question, say what you want to say, write a letter, today is mailbag Friday. In our Mailback Friday Nugget today, we'll find out the origins of Ash Wednesday with Dusty and Mercury. Hey Dusty. Hey uh, Mercury. What's that on your forehead? Ash, today's Ash Wednesday. Uh, Ash Wednesday? What is Ash Wednesday? Ash Wednesday is the day Lent begins. It occurs 40 days before Good Friday. Isn't that a pagan festival? No Mercury. Ash Wednesday originated in the 900s, long after pagan cults. It's a Christian tradition. Really? Is that why your forehead is marked with a cross? Yep, a mark on the forehead is a symbol of God's seal. Is that a Bible in your hand? Sure is. Why don't you turn to Revelation 7.3 and 9.4? Revelation. Oh, here it is. Revelation 7 verse 3. Do not harm the earth or the sea or the trees till we have sealed the servants of our God upon their foreheads. And Revelation 9 verse 4 The angels were told not to harm the grass of the earth or any green growth or any tree but only those of mankind who have not the seal of God upon their foreheads. But why ash, Dusty? Well, ashes symbolize mourning and penance. Back in the day, God's people even wore sackcloth. I'm glad we don't wear sackcloth anymore. That fashion is never coming back. I guess someone must be smoking way too much to gather all the ashes for everybody, huh? Not exactly. The ashes come from burning the previous year's palms, which we collected on Palm Sunday. Hmm, that's interesting, Dusty. Well, Mercury, there's another reason why we use ashes. 
It reminds us of our mortality. The priest, when marking the cross on our forehead, will say, Remember, men, that thou art thus, and unto dust thou shalt return. That's taken from the book of Genesis. You know, now that I think about it, the ashes on your forehead suit you, because you're dusty. Ha ha ha. Ha ha, very funny. Why are you called the Mercury? It represents Wednesday in Latin. Oh, what a coincidence. Now that you've listened and you've heard what Lent and Easter is all about, I want you to do two things for me. Now during Lent, which is 40 days, I want you to pray and to fast. Now what is fasting? This is sacrificing something that you love doing. It could be something that you eat or it could be something that you really have a habit of doing. Now, while you fast, you need to pray. So, I want you and your parents to make a prayer chain. Now, I'll show you the craft, okay? Next week, we'll be doing crafts and looking how to do a prayer chain, but it's a prayer chain that you do with family. I can't wait to see you next week, okay? So, before we go, I want you to remember, Lent is a time of fasting, Lent is a time of praying. What do we do? We fast and we pray. I'll see you guys next week. I'm so glad I could see you again. I hope you enjoy our new series. Bye. I will sing forever of your love. Come down with my hands to heaven. Shout your praises loud. I was lost in darkness, then you pulled me out. I will sing forever of your love. Come down. I once was blind, I could not see. Chains of sin had shackled me, but God is. Jesus rescued me. Jesus, Jesus rescued me. I will sing forever of your love. Come down with my hands to heaven. Shout your praises loud. I was lost in darkness, then you pulled me out. I will sing forever of your love. Come down. my soul and hope eternal won't let go my dead erased at calvary jesus jesus rescued me jesus jesus rescued me i will sing forever on your love come down with my hands to heaven shout your praises loud i was lost in darkness then you Sing forever of your love come down.